Andrew, you just made it into the top 10. How do you feel you fared? Um, well, I'm pretty ecstatic to be in there, really. You know, there's some, like, the best guys in the world, really. So to hang on to the tail of them is pretty good. Yeah, so, I mean, but when you get in there, it's like you just got to go. And if you have a good run, you have a good run. If you have a bad run, then you're just struggling all the way through. So. Yeah. How was your run? Uh, it was pretty ropey, yeah. So, <laughs> but, you know, it was, it's good. It's only the second time I've been in here, so it's pretty nerve-wracking and stuff. So, But it's, it's good to be in here and stuff, and hopefully... The judges think it's okay, and you know I've got a lot of work to actually make it into the top five for the next round, really. So, realistically, if I move up a couple of places from tenth, I'll be really happy. Uh, but to make it into the top five is pretty tall order, really. I think. So, what's the most challenging part with the pressure in the top ten? I'm um, just dealing with it, really. I mean, there's a lot of pressure on you because you've you've worked for the last 12 months to get here, and then when you get here, this is like the chance you want, and you really don't want to stuff it up. So you put yourself under more pressure than anyone else, really. You know, everyone else is just cheering for you and hoping you do well. Whereas you put yourself under a lot of pressure because, you know, you get it, your whole career you aim to get here. When you finally get here, you don't want to stuff it up because you might not get back here again. So, What's going through your mind as you're out there, you're making the shoes, you know who your competitors are, also the top farriers in the world? Um, you're just trying to do the best you can do, really. I mean, realistically, everyone looks at the points and says, well... To, to make it up to that next bracket, I've, I've really got. I had to win this class to get up to the next bracket, and there's not the possibility of doing that when you've got guys like Billy Carruthers and you know Stephen Bean and those guys. They're, they're really firing on all cylinders at the minute, so you, you're chasing their tail. But if I can move up a couple of places, that was my main goal to so just try and keep an even, consistent score all the way across. But I don't know. It, it's a tough one because you know when you get to this stage, everyone wants to win and everyone's here to do their best. So you just hope for the best and. Can we expect to see you here next year? Yeah, damn, damn sure. Yeah, definitely. No worries about that. Yeah, we'll definitely be back. Unfinished business. <laughs>